Hi guys, how is everybody doing? Welcome back to my channel. Make her mine, I'm a make her mine. So I'll make her mine, I'm a make her mine. In case you're new here, my name is Ndetambiri and this is Sprinkle of Sad. It's been a minute. <laughs> it's been a minute since I did a video and one that is makeup related. Um, as you can see, I don't have any makeup on yet. And that's because I'm doing a very exciting video today. Currently, it is quite dark. I'm filming in such a dark room. It's not like late at night, but it's, it's dark. I'm going to be testing out a product that I recently got. So I only have my brows on because I did that off camera because it's usually kind of tedious to do it in front of the camera for some reason, I don't know why. So um, I got this um, eyeshadow, yeah, so I got this eyeshadow and apparently, uh, okay, let me start from the beginning. I've been seeing so many people creating amazing looks with neon pigments and I always wanted to get my hands on some, you know, like even if it's one. So I was there scrolling the internet and doing my research and whatever and I found some that actually glow in the dark. So it was quite hard to find. So I ended up buying this one on Amazon. It was about 700 Kenya shillings, which is quite expensive because I don't even know if it will work. So I decided to test this out with you guys. So I'm going to be um, applying it on my eyes. I'm not going to apply it with anything else. And then we're going to see if it actually glows in the dark because it's very dark. I would just need to switch off my lights. I, I don't know how I'll do it, but we'll see. So I haven't opened it yet. Ooh, okay. So you peel something off. It comes like, you know, the powders. I don't know how to explain it. Um, let me just this up. Okay. Okay. So it's quite, it's green. Yeah, I think this is green. It's beautiful. Okay, so we're going to test it out. So um, I'm going to do my base with you guys. When I was doing my research, most people were recommending you to put a really light base if you don't have a white one. Like there are these white concealers. So if you have that, that would be a perfect base. But I really tried to find a white concealer. No one has them. So I just settled on my normal um, uh, Illegal Pro Concealer, which is what I'm going to be using as my base. And then in my research, I also found out that you don't, um, you know, like other eyeshadows you blend. This one you're not supposed to blend, you're supposed to pack. So we're going to be testing those out. I spent so long trying to find out how to correctly apply this thing so that it doesn't fail. So yeah, we're going to see how this goes. So I'm just going to apply um, a ton of my concealer and then we can see how the pigment will wear. Okay. Also with other um, other shadows, you usually put the base and then you, uh, what do you call it, powder it with some powder before you put your shadows. This one you're supposed to put it on a wet sticky base. So that's what you're going to be doing. Okay, I look scary, but it's for a good cause. It's for a good cause. So I've blended in my concealer so now I think we should just begin with our powder now I don't know how it's supposed to come out these things are quite messy and I don't want to look terrible and I have on a white shirt so we're going to try and do this as carefully as possible okay hmm let's see so I'm going to pack it and not blend it so Put this aside. Pack. Oh my god, it's so messy. Oh my god. It's so pretty, but it's so messy. Okay. Wow, it's beautiful. Oh my god. Oh my god. I 
don't know if you can see this oh my god it's so beautiful but then it's like quite patchy i don't know hmm. maybe i should just keep packing some more it's so pretty but it's so patchy i don't know if you can see i know everything just looks crazy but let me try it with some more Okay, let's do the other eye. I don't know. I don't know about this. Okay. It's quite pretty. But I'm, I'm wondering. Like it's patchy. It's so patchy. <laughs> it's so patchy. Let's see if we can fix this. Okay. Um, I'm going to drag it up Kidogo. Why is it patchy? That's my question. Why is it patchy? And when you try and blend it out, it like disappears. What is this? What is this? Okay, I'm trying one more time to pack it. Otherwise, this will be <laughs> a disaster. And I didn't want to put other shades like to blend it in. I wanted to see how it performs on its own. This is crazy. Okay, but you can still see how bright it is. It's so freaking bright. Oh my god, it's so bright. Okay. Nope, it's just not sticky. This, this is... <laughs> it better glow in the dark. Because it's so messy. Okay, fine. That that's the best that I could because I don't I don't know if it's going to get better than that. So I'm just going to blend um oh my god. This this is what we have. <laughs> oh my god, this this doesn't seem right. I feel like a clown. I feel like a clown. Okay, so I'm going to um put on my lashes and then we see because lashes make everything look better so if it can't look better with lashes then we're doomed so i'm going to try put some lashes on okay so i've put my lashes on and i'm not liking this shadow i'm not like it's so patchy in like one hour it won't look like i have any eyeshadow like i had any eyeshadow at all like that's how bad it is like i've tried um looking in this tiny tiny mirror to like see closer to my face this is like the worst thing ever like it's terrible oh my god no this 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 isn't it let me just close my eyes so that you can take a minute to see what I'm saying I hate wasting money I hate wasting money I hate wasting money so um, I think I'm just going to finish the rest of my makeup 
off camera then we come back and test if it actually glows in the dark despite applying terribly like this this let me see what it says over here it's a stargazer eye dust i'm not impressed I am not impressed. If anything, I'm disappointed. Yeah, I'm disappointed. Okay, so I am back. I have finished the rest of my face. And I'm still disappointed, honestly. Like, I mean, it's bright. It's a bright color, but why is it patchy? Like, there's still some areas that you can clearly see that there's no um, product so I don't know I don't know let me move in closer so you can see like I don't know there's just a way that you can tell there's some places there's no product and it's patchy yeah so that is the biggest concern I have so now <laughs> we're going to go into the fun part the part that everyone has been waiting for me too don't worry so we're supposed to see if it's glow in the dark like if it glows in the dark so i was thinking of how to do this so i have my phone and i think i'm going to turn off the lights and then use the flash from my phone to see if it glows in the dark i think I think that will be the best way to actually see if it glows in the dark like i'm quite excited and if it does then we can forgive the patchiness we can just wear it on our body like some paint or something so yeah let me switch off the ring light and then we see if we glow in the dark okay so i've switched off the lights um uh, let's see i'm going to turn on my flashlight Here is my flashlight. I don't see anything. Okay, I don't know if it's something I'm doing wrong, but I'm not seeing it glowing in the dark like how it's supposed to. I mean, glow in the dark is supposed to be glow in the dark, like glow in the dark i'm not seeing that i i'm not seeing that unfortunately i'm not seeing that but like i had spilled some on the table and i was kind of seeing it but then i'm also not seeing it probably because it's not that dark outside yet but i mm, 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 mm. i'm not convinced i am not convinced so to me this was a fail this 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 as much as i would want it to work this is a fail because i'm not seeing it like you know how things glow in the dark probably it's a problem with my light because uh like people use uv light right so i'm not sure like this 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 should have worked either way because it's glow in the dark whether it's uv light or not but yeah so i'm going to have to say this is a fail and yeah <laughs> i'll probably try it out again like and go to a completely dark place so that i can tell you guys for sure but mm -mm, i am not for it right now like eh, i don't think so even the application is terrible so it's not worth it to me so that's my honest um, review. So that is the end of today's video. Thank you so much for being here, for watching the whole video. Thank you so much. I really, really do appreciate it. And we are growing every single day. And I might not be able to say it, but I appreciate you all the time. 
I try and respond to all the comments. I always like all the comments. I always give a heart to all the comments so that you know that I see what you say. And yeah, I, I want to thank you guys so much for being here because I love being on YouTube and being creative. So it's nice to see that I get support from the people I'm creating for. So that is the end of today's video. I really do hope you enjoyed it. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel. You can follow me on Instagram at Dutangwiri or at Sprinkle of Sass. Also, I have a TikTok, so I'll be making them TikToks, but not like the dances, but I do make TikToks also at Dutangwiri. So you can check that out if you'd like to see some of that. And yeah, that is the end of today's video. See you in the next one. Bye!